Hello everyone, Abel in Vegas here, and I've been wanting to do a recap of the case that I opened for 2022 Topps Heritage. I've just been pretty busy, but I'm finally getting a chance to sit down today to get this recorded. So first let's recap um, the box toppers that I received. Um, and then throughout the video, I'm going to do a couple giveaways for some of the cards that I received. So stay tuned for those. And I'll let you know how you guys can participate. So each um, box came with a box topper. Some of the cards that were included were cards from back from 70, um, 72. Um, so we have this one. The Red Slugging Ties the Series. This is from World Series game number 6. Card number 208. And then they have a little stamp here. 50th Anniversary of Tops. Here we have a Ed Brinkman. For the Tigers. We have Don Buford. For the Orioles. Tom Machek and Ivan Murrell, Murrell. Then we had these cool little um, box toppers that were like oversized cards. So here we have Willie Mays in uh, Mets uniform. We have Jacob DeGrom. And we have Reggie Jackson. So I am going to be posting. Um, I'm going to be giving these three cards away. And I'm going to do it through my Twitter channel. So if you want an opportunity to get to win one of these three cards. And you're on Twitter. Then find me at Abel in Vegas. That's the Twitter handle name. Um, and I'm going to set it up so that if you want one of these cards, it's going to be a retweet. If you want the Jacob DeGrom, it's going to be a like. You know, so if you want that card, retweet the tweet. If you want this one, like. If you want a chance to win. And then if you want a chance to win the Reggie Jackson, then do a quote tweet. And in the quote tweet, all you need to do is do hashtag Able in Vegas. And that's going to give you the opportunity to, to win one of these cards. And I think I'm going to open, have this um, um, contest open and, and do the giveaways on Memorial Day. So if you want a chance to win those, head over to my Twitter um, and, and follow the instructions. We also had two additional, uh, a few more additional cards because there was one per box. Um, Gary Cole, nice oversized. I know who this is going to. We had this cool big oversized Randy or Rosarena. And then for my PC, we had a Mookie Betts. Cool looking um, oversized card here in a Dodger uniform. And then we also had a pretty cool looking Juan Soto. So these are what the backs look like. As you know, I opened the case trying to find Wander Franco's. Unfortunately, I did not hit any uh, type of short print for Wander or any Chrome card. Uh, but we did hit 11 total Wanders. That means they fall at one per or on average one per box so one box did not include a wander uh, so that we had one two three four five six seven eight of his base uh rookie cards um, and none of them on the back have the distinction for being a short print so like i said we didn't hit any of them but at least i got some wanders we and then we pulled three of the insert for new age performers so again nothing special there but we did get a few 
Then we move on to the inserts. So the chrome inserts that we have. I'm still not sure what I'm going to do with these. Uh, because these are nobody that I really PC. Uh, but we have Nolan, Arenado, Rodon, Vado, Strasburg, Mullins, Olsen, Mustakas, Darvish, Freeman, and Glaber Torres. So those were um, the purple inserts that uh, for players I don't PC. We did get several image variation short prints. So here is the Yadier Molina. And on the back, it'll say here image. So that's how you know that it's a variation. A Brendan Marsh rookie card image variation. A Garrett Cole image variation. Shohei Otani image variation. And a Pete Alonso image variation so those were those inserts then unfortunately as a Dodger fan I did get a couple hits that were for the Astros fan or the Astros team so there was a purple chrome insert for Michael Brentley and then we got two relics one was Carlos Correa that's a swatch and the other one is Jose Altuve a piece of his lumber so I'm going to do another giveaway uh, since I don't collect uh, um, the Houston Astros uh, so this is the second opportunity that you have to enter the giveaway contest and this one will be available for those of you here on YouTube all you have to do to enter this contest is in a comment on the video um, do the hashtag and then do able in Vegas and then underneath that put uh, the order of which so that if you get chosen as a winner um, who would you want as the first pick who you want as the second pick and which one of these cards you would take as your third pick and then um, so the we'll pick the three winners and the winner that I pick first, whatever number one you have, that's what you'll win. Whoever got the second choice from the two cards that I left, whatever is your top choice, you will win. And then the third person, whoever wins, then they'll get the third card. So Houston Astros, uh, my pain is your gain. Um, so that's, that's the giveaway number two for this video. We go on to some more of the, of the hits. Um, now, each box of Heritage either had a relic or an autograph. So we have for the Orioles, uh, Ryan Mountcastle. Uh, Tampa Bay, Brandon Lowe. Lowe. We have Javier Baez. Uh, Bat. Uh, we have a Herman Marquez. Joey Votto, Jose Abreu, and then for the autographs, we got an Orlando Cepeda, uh, the rookie autograph of Yanni Hernandez for the Rangers, and then just so you know when I'm actually recording this video, a Reed Detmers autograph. And he just happened to pitch uh, a no-hitter for the Angels. So, pretty cool pull there. And then, we did get three black-bordered cards. Now, these on the back are actually not numbered. But according to the checklist, these black-bordered cards are num limited to 50 copies. So we have Henter Renfro. We have a J.D. Davis. And we got a rookie card. Fortunately, it's a pitcher. Uh, but it is a rookie card of Luis Gill. Another relic that I pulled was Rafael Devers. And then some of the Chrome cards that we pulled... We have Mike Trout, 
nice looking trout. So these are the ones that I'm keeping for my PC. We have Trey Turner for the Dodgers. Bueller. Uh, Buster Posey, I know that I don't really collect Giants cards, but I believe this would be the last card that we may see him in a uh, Giants jersey since he did retire. So that's the only reason why I put it in my um, key pile. But who knows, maybe later down the road I may move it. We have a Randy. Luis Robert. We did get a triple rookie outfielders with Ramos, Dykeman, and Miller. We have a rookie card of TJ Friedel. A Matt Manning uh, rookie card. Another triple rookie pitchers of Pop, Bender, and Thompson. Uh, Brandon Marsh, rookie in the purple refractor. Seth Beer in the purple. And a Vidal Brujan. So right team, wrong player for the Rays. Then some of the other chrome cards that we got was a base chrome uh, rookie of Griffin Jacks for the Twins. Shane Baz for the Rays. A nice chrome refractor of Ronald Acuna Jr. And these are numbered to 673. We got a red refractor of Randy Orozarena. A, reed, a red refractor of Lindor. And these red are number to 573. And I think the case hit of the box was pulling this gold. Raphael Devers, number 2 of 5. So there you have it. That was the a recap of a full case of 2022 Topps Heritage. So if you want to enter the contest, please leave a comment um, on YouTube. Um, just follow the instructions. If you want to enter the one on Twitter, go find the, 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 the tweet on my Twitter. And then I will pick the winners, I think, on Monday of Memorial Day since I'll be off that day. So thanks guys for watching and catch you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Some of my cards are available for purchase on Check Out My Cards. Follow my collecting adventure on Instagram and Twitter. Links are available in the description below. Support my YouTube journey by clicking on the subscribe button and turning on the notifications. Catch you on the next one.